so today we are going to read a book that we have already read in class because this week you are going to get to work on a special project with your family or anyone else that is at home with you. You will get to make a cape just like the one in the story. But first I want you to listen to the story so you can remember what our book was about. The author of this book is Lauren Castillo. I went to stay with Nana at her new apartment in the city. I love my Nana, but I don't love the city. The city is busy. <laughs> the city is filled with scary things. It is no place for a Nana to live. Nana says the city is wonderful, bustling, booming, and extraordinary. She says it is the perfect place for a Nana to live. At night, the room rumbles and shakes. There is no sleeping here. Nana, aren't you afraid in the city? It is busy, loud, and filled with scary things. Nana gave me a kiss, tucked my blanket in nice and tight. Tomorrow, she said, I will show you how wonderful the city is. When I woke up in the morning, Nana was holding a fancy red cape for you to wear on our walk today, she said. You'll see that the city is not scary at all. I felt brave in my cape. We got ready and left the apartment. The city was busy. The city was loud. But Nana was right. The city was not filled with scary things. Mm, looks like New York City. It is New York City. There is so much for a Nana to do in this city. When it is time to leave, I wrap Nana in my cape. This will keep you brave, I tell her. The city is busy, the city is loud, and the city is the perfect, is the absolute perfect place for a Nana to live. and for me to visit. The end. So Vroom Three Friends, just like I said, now you get to make your own cape at home. You can draw the cape on paper. You can make it out of maybe a jacket around your neck. You can make it out of a pillowcase, a sheet, anything that you have in your homes. What are you gonna make your cape out of to make you feel extra brave? I also want to know, when is a time that you feel brave? When is a time that you feel brave? See you next time.